welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this jp infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a python project which is entitled as fraud detection and analysis for insurance claim using machine learning which is an ieee 2022 conference paper basically in this paper the authors have mentioned about the insurance company who are working on the commercial enterprise for the last few years they are this those insurance company are experiencing the fraud cases for all type of the claims basically this this fraud claims makes the serious problem for the insurance company as the amount claimed is very large so in this paper the authors have worked on an insurance claim data set to detect the fraud and fake claims that have been done uh, kindly note that we are not going to implement the same as mentioned in the base paper and we are going to do some modifications in it in the data set and the algorithm so now let us see what we have done it so the proposed algorithm that we have used is random forest classifier so our model that we have implemented is random forest classifier and the accuracy score that we have achieved is 99 percentage Now let me show you the data set. So this is the data set that we have used for the finding the fraud insurance claim data which has been referred from Kaggle and and here you can see the complete data set with the features and the record set in it. So this is the complete data set. Now let us see the execution of the project. So first copy the source code location. Go to your command prompt. Type cd and go to the project location and type python app.py and kindly wait and kindly make sure that before execution you're satisfied all the requirement that is required for this project by in installing the libraries required for this and now you can see the url copy this url go to any of your browser i'm going to firefox just paste the url and now you can see the home screen or welcome screen of the project with the project title fraud detection and analysis for insurance claim using machine learning now click the login menu and it will be navigated to the login page and kindly note that this is a static login page because we have not used any database in this project so just enter the default username and password as admin and admin and then click login and once the login is successful it will be navigated to the upload part where you need to upload the data set that we have shown to train up the system so just click the browse button and just go to the project folder where you can see upload.csv file just select this upload.csv and then click upload and after few seconds you can see that it will be navigated to the preview part where you can see the complete data set that we have uploaded so here you can see the complete data set has been loaded now which consists of around 4942 dataset records and now let us see the attributes that is available here you can see the attribute id month week of the month day of the week make accident area day of week climb month climb week of month climb sex marital status age fault policy type vehicle category vehicle price fraud found policy number represent number detectable driver rating days of policy accident days policy climb pass number of climbs age of vehicle age of policy holder police report filed witness present agent type number of supplements address change 
climb, number of cars, year and base policy. Um, these are all the attributes that is available in this data set and kindly scroll down till the end of the page and you can see all the data set has been loaded in the preview part. Now just click this claim, click to train or test button. And after a few seconds you can see training is finished message click OK. Now it will be navigated to the prediction part where you need to enter the test cases to find the case whether it is a fraudant or it is a genuine insurance claim. So now let me show you with a few cases. First case is like let me check with the month as July, day of the week as Saturday make as honda so just you can see all the data has been entered in the scroll down just you need to select the test data to which you need to check so just let me enter honda here an accident area is urban or rural so that is select urban and month climbed is september and day of the week climbed is tuesday and and sex is male and marital status is single age is 16.5 policy type is sudden all perils and vehicle category is sudden and vehicle price is more than 69,000 and directable is 400 driver rating is 1 days of policy accident more than 30 days of policy climb is sorry days of policy climb is more than 30 age of vehicle is it is a new one so let me select new age of policy boulder is 16 to 17 and police report file yes or no it is no and witness present is no number of cars is one vehicle and year is 1994 and base policy is all perils so this data that i have entered is from the data set record that we have trained up with so after entering your preferred data just now let us see the printed result for it so the printed result is it is a fraud claim so now let me go to the prediction menu again to enter the next case and check the date test data whether it is a fraud or genuine claim of it so next test data is like uh, for let me select month as june and day of the week is saturday make is toyota and accident area is rural month claimed is july day of week claimed is friday sex is male marital status is married age is 65 policy type is sedan all liabilities and vehicle category is port vehicle price is 20,000 to 29,000 and detectable is 400 driver rating is 2 days of policy accident is more than 30 and days of uh, policy climb is more than 30 age of vehicle is more than 7 
age of policy holder is 51 to 65 and police report filed is yes witness present is no and number of cars is one here is 1994 and base policy is about liability so now let us check the predicted result of us by clicking this prediction button and the predicted result is it is a non-fraud it is a legitimate um, claim of it so now finally let me show you some other case by clicking the prediction button now you can enter the details of it so, so now i have entered the other test case that is month as february day of the week is tuesday make is acura and accident area is urban month climbed is february Day of week climbed is Monday, sex is male, marital status is married, age is 50, policy type said in all perils, vehicle category said in, vehicle price deductible is 400, driver rating is 4 days of policy accident, more than 30 days of policy climb is more than 30, age of vehicle is more than 7, age of policy holder is 41 to 50, police report file no, witness present no, number of cars is 1 and year is 1996 base policy is all perils now let us see the predicted result of us by clicking the predict button so now let me click this predict and the predicted result is it is a non-fraud so in this case you can check with the other data set record that is provided for the test case or in the training data set now let us move to the next part that is the performance analysis now in the performance analysis uh, you can see the performance analysis parameters like recall f1 and precision values so here you can see the recall f1 and precision values of the fraud and non-fraud and uh, here you can see the confusion matrix of it and final is the chart part and kindly note this is a static chart and this is not a dynamic chart because we have not used any database in it and this ch uh, first chart depicts the no fraud as 60 percentage and fraud as 40 percentage this is depicted from the data set that we have trained up with and uh, then comes the category for the gender so the male is 52 percentage and female is 38 percentage and other is 8 percentage and now let me log out and this is all about the project fraud detection analysis or insurance climb using machine learning and thank you for watching